Well, what an interesting turn of events, eh, Churchill? What? Okay. Yvette's friend was rather rude. Didn't really appreciate that, but do you know what? We got her out, and that was our job. Can we, hello, can we go in here? Oh, Cow's Lick Milk Factory. Who are you? Who are you? What do you want? You'll... It's only after we've lost everything that we're free to do anything. I mean, okay, kind of. Uh, hi there. Hello. Hello. Syndicate pup. You right there, fella? I'm fine, thank you. Um, and who are you? Are you just another gentleman... Syndicate pup? Hello? Not the talkative type, eh? Edward storage. Can we get in this? It just looks like we might be able to get in it. No. All right. Come on. Come on, Churchill. Let's let's get out of here before something comes to do us in. Or of... okay, what's that? What is it? Ooh, what the hell is that? Oh, really? Really? The gun's not loaded. Okay, okay, okay. Ouch, 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 ouch. All right, all right. Why are we aiming off to the side here? What, what's going on? Okay, okay, right, okay, 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 okay. Oh god, okay, why? Yeah, okay, all right, all right. Okay, I'm in a hole. I'm in a hole. Why am I in a hole? Oh my god, all right. Can we, can we just, 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 just. just. Okay, it, it's annoyed with the, the... God! Grief! Alright, you, you... Stupid leech. This is, this is, this is, this is pointless. Alright. Get wrecked. Ugh. Just get out of it. Stop leeching on me, man. Okay, I don't know what's what was going on with my with my pistol there. Why is it aiming off to the? Is it broken? Churchill, are you here? Famished meat. What the hell is a famished? It looks like it crawled out of hell. Churchill, what 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 what? Is something wrong with my pistol? Is it broken? Does it need to be fixed? I don't I don't I don't quite get why it's why it's aiming off to the to the left. Well whatever. Whatever, 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 whatever. It's fine, it's fine, fine. Big cow. You're a cow! Okay. Well after that, um rude interruption, let's continue. Take the milk, please. Tickets. Um So is this the or is this just a spot? Because a kind of cure. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Don't. 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 Get out. Get out. Get out. Ooh, you. You filth. Absolute scum. Oh God. Am I bleeding profusely? Good God. <sighs> right. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at ourselves here. Um. Uh, crispy squirrel bits. Why, why not? Ooh. Okay, too much. Ah, we can, we can, we can, we can level up. Okay. Um. Hmm. What, what, what have we got? The mysterious stranger. A bloody mess. Ah, fortune finder. More tickets, maybe. Commando. Rigorous combat training means automatic weapons do 20% more damage. No. Gunslinger. Channel the spirit of the old west. Non-automatic pistols do 20% more damage. That might be handy for us. Science! Can't get into any more hacking. Gun nut. Shoot first, kill first with access to base level and rank 1 gun mods. Mm. Medic. <sighs> hmm. Ticket collector? Troubadour. K. 
chem resistant life giver. That might be handy. Lead belly. Take less radiation from eating and drinking. That might be useful, actually. Awareness. We could do with potentially being a little bit more aware. Hmm. Agility training, yes. Look. Hmm. I kind of feel... Ooh, locksmith too, though. Expert locks. Hmm, that might be handy to have there as well. Yes, we'll go with locksmith too. Why not? Thank you. I can now open more complex locks. All right, Churchill, let's... Um, let... What's through here? Hello? Oh, we can... Okay. You can hear those stupid bug things. Blech. Stingy. Go away. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Bloat fly. Just disgusting. Disgusting. Get out. Ugh. Is there something in here? Oh, hey. Will you just open it? Anti. Oh. Lee rad roaches. Get out. Get out. Oh. Churchill. We sorted him out. Okay. XYZ cleaner. Possibly useful. Uh, anything else here? Turpentine. Hey. Turpentine is always useful. Adjustable wrench. Eh. Combination spanner. Okay. Well. Anything here? Ashtray. Ooh. Are you alright, Churchill? I mean, you're a little bit bloody, my dear. That's kind of odd, but fine. Okay. Is this just a series of crates, I'm guessing? So, can we go inside here? We are supposed to be going to the hideout, but... Curiosity is calling my name, don't you know? Can we... Up. Up. Okay, yep. Can we get up there, do you suppose? Up. Oh, oh, uh, maybe, maybe not, hmm, okay, definitely not, all right, well, come on then, um, Churchill, let's, can we open this, yeah, oof, okay, gate to the face, lovely, what's that, oh, semi-skimmed milk, very nice, semi-skimmed was supposed to be green, though, Semi-skimmed is green top, and skimmed is red top. Look at this cow, Churchill. Very nice. A little cow. I like it. Uh, okay, can we... Yep, let's just... Yep. These milk floats. Ooh, is there milk in them? We Can we, can we have the milk? We can have the milk. Hey. Okay, so where is this safe house, then? Is it over the water? I don't think I'm going to be taking a dip. Let's just have a little peep on the map here. Ah, yes. So, hmm. We could always go back to the Greenwich Foot Tunnel. Which I think we're probably going to have to do. Purely because we need a means to, to get there. Yes, I think that's probably what we're going to have to do. All right. Well, come on then, Churchill. Let's um, make our way, my dear. Hopefully, we won't die a horrible death as well. Always preferable. Always preferable. All right. Now, now if I remember correctly, these boys on this here ship, the Cutty Sark are not um not particularly pleasant fellows which doesn't really help our case but thankfully I don't think we need to go near them which is which is good what's in here nothing curse it what's this oh the DLR of 
course. Ch Churchill, you need to be careful in the um, in the water, my dear. It's highly irradiated, and it will probably make you very, very sick. Yes, we need to be careful here, Churchill. Because anybody could be about. Mm. Old black cab. Ooh, with a suitcase in it. Um, I won't take the cap, thank you. I'm not much of a cap person. What's this? Greenwich Station. Should we... I kind of want to take a little peep. We'll just, we'll just take a peep. All right. So... Churchill. You need to chill out, man. This is, this is, this is... Okay. All right. I'm ready. I'm ready. Um, hello. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. Burnt comic. Lots of burnt comics. Ooh, beans. Hey. We'll always take the beans. Teddy. No, thank you. What's in here? Tickets. Thank you. Tills. Folders clipboards pre-war money don't know what we can possibly do with that but easy Churchill right just see if there's anybody up here oh I can hear a ghoulie ghoul but where is it oh hello I mean that works doesn't it okay um in these boxes. Is this just all just garbage on the floor? Hello? Is there anybody in here? Guess not. Okay. <laughs> How random. Uh, yeah. Okay. Alright. Well, it was worth a look. Just to see. Come on, Churchill. Let's go. We can um, we can have a little sniff around, I suppose. Just see what we can find. Tickets. Marvellous. Tickets are what we need, and they would be here, would they not? In um, underground stations. You know? Okay, you're... Yep. Yeah. You're very, very, very dead, which is brilliant. Okay. Anyone in here? Doesn't look like it. Good. Okay, tickets. It's cotton yarn. Use typewriter. I can't think I'll be writing any correspondence anytime soon. No. no. Um, cigarettes. I say, well, tickets. Marvellous. Okay. Hmm. Drinking glass. I'm not going to take the cigarettes because they're of no use to me. Churchill, can I please get out? Oh, tickets, tickets, tickets. Yes, tickets galore. Any other tickets? Ah, oh, look at this treasure trove. Okay, didn't, didn't, yep. Can I, yep, okay. Just took a brief, brief sit. Brief sit down. Okay. Any other tickets? Any other anything of any use. Doesn't look like it. What does the headline say? Peace in our time. Yeah, didn't last though, did it, unfortunately. What? Out of service. Not surprised. Okay, Churchill, let's um let's head back out, shall we? While the sun's setting, Churchill, maybe we should um get over to that that safe house sooner rather than later my dear I don't particularly wish to get caught out okay what was that what's that noise I don't I don't I don't I don't like this post box nothing in it all right Churchill come on this way puppy dog look at all the cars my god shocking is this it this is the 
Oh, madam, I do apologise. Um, yeah, I think your parcel's late. All right, let's just, 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 just. So, can we? A smoking lounge. I mean, I don't smoke, but okay. the door behind you. We did it. All I right. can't believe we pulled it off and we're all back in one piece. My heart is literally beating out of my chest. Well, you should have seen how those syndicate dogs scattered when the bomb went off. Like little puppies leaving trails of piss behind them as they ran. Lovely. It was beautiful. I've got to be honest. I was not thrilled to see you when you first showed up. Oh, thanks. But I'll be damned if you didn't save the day. Thank you. Well, there you go. Um... Yeah, well, I'm happy to help. Yeah. Well, it's very much appreciated. I'm sure Blind Nelson and Gaunt will feel the same way. Oh, yeah. Those two. Oh, wow, that's loud. Okay. Good to hear your voice, Gaunt. And thanks to our trusty lab right here, me and Uma are alive and kicking. Over. Oh, it's not gone. It's Johnny. Christ, it's good to hear your voice, too. You guys shouldn't have run off like that. Go on, one best pleased. Threw a chair at Nelson, he did. Yeah, well. Yeah, they're right here beside me. Over. Oi, Labra. Nice yes. work out there today. Uh, I think I'll speak for everyone on this end of the microphone when I say you finally proved yourself loyal to our little family. Uh, I better come back to see what Gorn has to say, though. Better get your bums back to the swan when the heat dies down. Over now. Over. Over. Wonder if they'll be a little bit more pleasant to us now and not so bloody rude. This is quite fancy though, isn't it? Okay, what's this? Uh, a cigarette card wild animal number 43. Ooh. I mean, what is it? It's a, a duck bill or platypus. Well, okay. Um, yeah, I'll take it. Tickets, folder, radio. Um, I'll be out in a mo. I'm just gonna have a little peep round in here, make sure there's nothing of any any value or interest to me. Crystal liquor decanter. Ah, um, hmm. burnt textbooks. Wow, lots of burnt textbooks. Expired cigarette pattern. No, thank you. Tickets. Hey, hey. We will always accept the tickets. Oh, are these all empty. All right, Churchill. You're a good puppy, aren't you, really? You're a little noisy sometimes, and you do get underfoot, but you're a good one. Oh, right. Well, I suppose we'd better head back to the Swan and Mitre then, if, if that's the case. Why are the suits here? Twill suits. Don't even want to know. Okay, sealed newspaper? All right. Well, ooh. Leather bag. I don't really need the leather. Ooh, okay, sorry, sorry. Oh, um, I'm just going to, yeah. What's that? Pinstripe suit. Leather bag. Bowler hat. whole lot of hats in here. Hmm. All right, let's go. Okay. Jill. Oh, what have you found? All right. Shh, 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 shh. Be quiet. Moshy peas and expired cigarettes. Well, it's something. Okay, we need to head back to the Swan and the Swan and Mitre. Okay. We need to be careful because this this could get really dangerous. Being out at night like this. Mm. All right. So, in terms of in terms of the Swan and Mitre, we do have quite a distance to travel, do we not? I think we need to go around this wall here, towards the Royal Observatory, and down towards the Swan and Mitre. Yes. Okay. Well. Go past Greenwich Station and then... Um, oh, who are you? Oh, it's the girls. Hey! Well, we'll follow them. Stick with you guys, eh? I mean, 
You can walk a little faster than that, you know. Oh dear. I know I shouldn't want to know, but I do. I do. I do. I do. I do want to know. What's this? What? Tricky Ricky? What? What? Blueberries. I mean, what the what happened here? Vagabond blazer? Churchill, what's the matter, puppy? What the hell happened here, then? Oh my god, look at this. Okay. Rad away. Fashionable glasses, come on now. More bodies getting shite done, never hurt anything. Hmm. Well, all right. What's this? A church. Well, it's a little late to be going to church, I'm afraid. Churchill? Haha. Uh -huh. Is it this way? Ladies? Are y'all coming? Where did they go? Oh, there you are. I mean, y'all are a little slow. What's going on here? It's going to be a long night, Churchill. A long night indeed. What's this? Okay. Ministry of Defence. Okay. Okay. Is this a... Oh, Churchill! Bloody hell, dog. You've got to be a little bit more respectful of these folks. I mean, granted they're all dead, so I suppose it, you know... Ooh, okay, there's another toolbox here. Okay. Churchill. I think it's this way, puppy dog. Anything in there? No. All right. Well, we'll just have to um, go carefully and with great caution. Yes, indeed. Okay, this is a little busy. What saber tooth Sid? You yeah, alright, um, sir? Excuse me? Okay. Um, maybe I better put, put the button away. Just, 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 you know. Don't want to get in trouble, do we, Churchill? Alright, um, so we need to speak to our, oops, our friend here. Gaunt? Gaunt, Well, hello. well, our little wayfarer has returned. Yes, I You're have. You're looking in a lot better nick than when we first found you, I must say. Oh, all right. I've been paying mind to what you've been up to round there. Seems you're not a bad sort, me old mucker. I'm all right. So listen, i got an opportunity for you. No. Oh. You can keep on doing odd jobs for us. Help out here and there for a few tickets. Or you can step up to the big game. I'm offering you the chance to join the ranks of the Vagabonds. Join our family proper. Oh. Your blood becomes our blood. Our fate becomes your fate. What do you say? Um, hmm. Well, why do you want me to join? Truth be told, I'm not sure of you myself. But Blind Nelson says he smells something special about you. And I'd be fucking barmy to ignore his nouse. I've got me some big plans coming up, and if you've got the right skills, you could play a big part in them. Well, he didn't seem to take much of a liking to us last time, even though I fixed his bloody radio for him. Okay, um, so what's in the fate for the Vagabonds, eh? In a word, revenge. Oh. We've been at war with the fucking Isle of Dogs Syndicate for ten years. Oh dear. And for too much of that, we've been on the back foot. We need to switch things up, take the war to them, and win it. Win it for good. And after that? One step at a time, eh? That's a big enough job for now. Oh, all right. Um, what's in it for me? Weapons, armor, support, mm -hmm. a bit of status in the streets, and protection if you're ever in a corner. Us vagabonds look after our own. Now, we ain't the only gang about, but unlike the rest, we ain't leeches. 
We ain't lording it over others, and we ain't fucking lunatics. You want to be someone's pawn? Go somewhere else. Oh. You want to be part of a real community? This is the place to be. Um. Yeah, all right. I'm interested. Glad your gun's on our side. That's what I like to hear. But now, let's not get ahead of ourselves. I still have a task for you before you join proper. Of course. You We're do. on a war footing, and every new recruit has to prove their value for the effort. You want to join the vagabonds? You gotta show your loyalty and your worth. The job is straightforward. Put down a dog and bring me its collar. Not just any dog, though. I want the blood of a syndicate enforcer captain, and I want its lapel pin in my hand as proof of the deed. Do that and you'll truly be one of us. Speak to Nelson for more info. The other lieutenants can kit you out with some gear. My mother wanted me to be a farmer. Well, I mean... I get me hands dirty in other ways. We could use some, ge some gear, Churchill. He wasn't talking about you, by the way. The Isle of Dogs Syndicate he was talking about, and, well... We've met enough of them to know that they're, they're probably not good news. Okay, um, where is this gentleman? Are you here? Hello? Oh, there you go. What you after? Can I, um, hmm. Yeah, sure, I'm on a mission. you need the right weapon for the job. You fancy a shooter or a slicer? Um... I'll take a gun. Right, here you go. If you hang around, a crown pistol. We need the numbers. What I mean, you after? Are you got anything else for sale? I'd like to sell you. Okay, never mind. Bye. All right. What? What is a crown pistol? The, 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 I've got to know. Where is it? Where is it? A crown pistol. Ah. Uh, I mean, it's not bad. It's not bad. So, put it there for now. All right. Is there anything? Can we not use his? We really? Can we not use your your workbench, dude? Come on now. You know we're good. We're we're good folks. Ugh. How annoying. How massively irritating. Good grief. Okay, who else? Who else? Can we have? getting shot down never hurt anything. No, I'm sure it didn't, Nelson. I'll talk to you shortly, my dear. Chem station. I don't think any chems. Uh, lovely. Okay. Chill, chill. Out the road. Thank you. Ah, here we go. Chill Winston, do, mate. who seems to have been quite nice to us. Uh, I'm going for a spot of dog hunting. Gaunt sent me for supplies. Hey, no trouble. I had fresh deliveries of chems and medicines today. Which would you rather have your mitts on? Medicines, definitely, please. Medical supplies, no chems. Here you go, mate. Thank you. Can I can I sell you, you some things? No, you no. Be seeing you. Oh. Will nobody take my goods? Okay. Watch your back, because I can see exactly where my knife would fit. Excuse me? So bloody rude, honestly. Okay. Ah, Johnny. Right, lab rat. Yes. What can I do for you? Uh, Gaunt wants me to kill a syndicate captain. He said you could give me some gear to help. Gaunt wants more filler blood, eh? Time to kill us some more doggies. Ah, well. If that's your job, then I can help you live through it, I hope. If you're planning a straight fight, then I can give you some armour. Okay. But if you want to be all tactical like, then you can't go wrong with some well timed grenades. Ooh. Do you know what? Maybe I'll take the armour. Grenades are handy, but. Sure thing. Here you go. Armour stops you, you getting hurt, hurt which is you'll great. Mind my bullets. Why is everybody so aggressive, man? Good lord. Can I sell you things? What's your poison? Ah, here we go. Uh, what have you got? Take a look. Okay. All right. First things first. I would like to sell all my junk, please, because I have a lot of it. And um, do 
I think I'm gonna sell my gas mask, maybe. I don't know. Well, enjoy. Thank you. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. Okay, yeah, uh, Nelson, you want to talk? Let's talk. Are you going to be a little bit uh, less rude this time? Hello, young plum. Young plum. Um. Maybe we should ask. Gaunt seems fixated on re revenge. You know why? You ain't her. No. The syndicate done in his mum and dad. Oh God. Happened about ten years ago. At what we call the Red Treaty was supposed to be a peace treaty. Gabriel Gaunt joining with Thomas Black to form a united front after driving out the Normans. But Black took the opportunity to take out the whole senior leadership of the Vagabonds, and out of the wreck he grabbed most of East London. Sounds very, um... Red Wedding-esque. Okay, so, um... What happened to him after his parents died? They were only young, but he took over the gang as soon as news broke of what happened. Okay. It were hard at first, but we stuck by him and he's kept the gang going. I'm right proud of the lad, I'll tell you that. Alright, so where were you during the Red Treaty? I was right there, standing next to Gabriel when they shanked him. <gasps> Last thing I saw was him slumping to the ground whilst they grabbed his Mary. Last thing I saw. Then, instead of killing me, they plucked my eyes out. Said I would be the only witness, and that's all I could live for. Wow. A cruel one, that black. Cruel and clever. He wanted me to live as a show of what happens when something gets in his way. Aye, and what a useful prop I've been since. Let's talk about something else. Yeah, uh, okay, so he's asked me to kill a syndicate enforcer, Captain. I mean, can you give me any help? Help? I can't help with that. Can't even see enough to help you. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, so You've funny. got to do this on your own. No hand-holding. But I'll give you a bit of background so you know what you're in for. That's what the I wanted. The syndicate has an enforcement division known by locals as the Sniffers. The Sniffers. Their oh whole God. job is to keep the peace, as they call it, meaning meeting out a bit of the old ultraviolence against anything they consider subversive. Pretty cruel bunch, by all accounts. They tend to wander around in small groups round Millwall, looking for trouble. You'll find a few round Tower Hamlets in the Dome, too. Each group has a captain, and they're usually smart and tough. You want to get that pin off their collar, you got to be smarter and tougher. And they ain't the complacent type, so don't expect no shortcuts here. Like I said, no hand-holding on this one. You're on your own, I'm afraid. Do please try not to die. Oh, you care now, do you? You bloody care. Really? So I have to get a lapel pin. Hey, Mickey. You okay, dude? Hello? Not much of a talker, eh? That's fine. Well, I mean, what do you reckon, Churchill? Are we game for this? I could do with some medical attention, really. Do y'all have a doctor here? At all? Anyone who could um, fix me up? I'm a little busted, a little broken, a little radiated. What have I got by way of by way of aid? I do have some right away. Why not? Why not? Get rid of the rads. Shall we not? Okay. And then I will have a little little nibbly nibble. There we are. Oh, healthy once more. Okay, well we'll get a night's sleep, I think, and um Didn't your mum teach you better. Let's just, just, I, hmm. Incredibly rude, this lot. Oh, is it? Really? What else is up here? Potato cri crisp. Sabretooth Sid, hello. Hey there, young'un. Okay, hello. Not from these ends, are you? Jesus. My name's Sid. Hello, Sid. Well, the boys here call me Sabretooth. I'm looking for a little help with something. I can make it worth your while. All right. Uh, what's the problem? Excuse me, I was talking. Very rude. What's the problem? Listen here. I'm only telling you this as you're an outsider. But I'm no good with my letters, see? That's fine. Your ma always wanted me to learn them. But my dad said it would make me weak in the head. Well, I'm getting old now. And I've had my share of adventures. But my one big regret is never learning how to read proper. Maybe now I can finally play catch up. But 
I don't want the boys here knowing about this. Can you? That's why I'm looking for help from someone like you. Okay. I've got a little something special for you. Can you go away, Uma? Get the goods I need. You in? Uh, it's a noble aim. I'm glad to help. That's kind of you, kid. It ain't easy keeping this secret, but maybe there's hope to learn, even at my age. I know some basics. If I can get the right materials, I'm sure I could get better. Okay. Thing is, there's bugger all to read around here. Some old menus and magazines, but no proper books. And I need me some books if I want to learn proper reading. You ever hear of a library? Used to be loads of them before the war, all full of books. Oh, yeah. They're mostly ruined now. But there's a few still about. There's one not far from here, in fact. Oh, okay. Um, can't you just head there yourself? Maybe a little old for Too it. Too many ghouls about. Ah. I can hold me own in a one-on-one -on -one fight, but I can't take on a whole group. A strapping kid like you, though. No problems. Oh. Get me three or four books and decent nick, and I'll give you something special in return. Any particular books you want? Nothing too hard. Kid stuff, even. I need to start out simple. If you can find it, there's a little story called Dove's Dilemma. Dove's I remember Dilemma. from when I was young. It'd be nice to see you again. Um. Yeah, okay, I'll see what I can get. Thanks. My mother wanted me to be a farmer. Okay. I get my hands so Sid enough. wants some books. Me again, and there'll be consequences. I have just offered to help you. God, so bloody rude, honestly, these people. Never have I been spoken to in such a manner in all my life. Take those tickets. Just because I can't. What is this B B M B M B I M T fair? Curiosity. I'm taking it anyway. Consider that. Your attacks are being rude. To me. Hello! Hello, you alright? Uh, just don't mind me, I'm just having a little... Whoa. Okay, a lot of pre-war money. Churchill, please. Thank you. Oh. Thought the terminal was, um... Well. Active, should we say. Ooh. Little bathroom here. Is there... Wow. Kinda nice. Kinda nice. Churchill, can you move out of the way, dog? Alright. Well, I suppose we will um, go and have a little snooze and then go and find these bloody books. Oh. Um. Well, this is not the Swan and Mitre, is it?